Hey guys, what is going on? It is Constantine, aka Smart God Commentaries, and this is a very special and fun commentary for me to make. Um, wow, so much to start off with. Um, first things first, uh, I hit 100 subscribers, which I really want to thank you guys for. So, as I said in my last video, I'm going to do a PlayStation Network card or Microsoft Points card giveaway, but only for the United States because um, my parents don't really know about this channel, so they wouldn't be able to uh, use their credit cards to buy international points cards. So just if you're in if you're in the United States, just tell me Microsoft points or PlayStation Network card points, and all you have to do is be subscribed, and I'll give it away in the next video, and I'll just send you the the number for it, and you can use it. And uh, okay, second thing, um, someone made me a background on my channel and a logo, so I think you guys should go check that out. Uh, I put him in the about me section. I'll probably put him in the uh, <clears throat> I'll probably put him in the in my other channels box section. I'll make that. And uh, third thing <laughs> is this is a flawless 42 and 0 Moab by Ghostly Snipes. Uh, he's my friend on PlayStation 3, and uh, his YouTube channel is um, is uh, I'll put it in the description. So uh, okay, let's get on to today's commentary. I have my little uh, my notes prepared. I was doing this in school <laughs> in school yesterday and the day before yesterday, uh, just taking notes in classes when I got bored. So um, I was thinking recently about going back in time so just just imagine this uh... the point of today's commentary is just kinda get to, to get you guys to think you know about like all this crazy stuff um, just think about if you were to go back in time as an immortal so you just went back in time and just, you just could not die if you went back to like way before any of these inventions were made just just listen to all these inventions and just just think about how you would possibly try to even to make one of these like the light bulb, radio, television, computer, wheel, engine, uh, electricity, boats, clothes, hot water, iPod, bottles, shoes, microscopes, parachutes, music, YouTube, internet, bombs, guns, trains, airplanes, refrigeration, cars, basketball, football, like sports, like that, golf, space, shuttles, clocks, satellites, printers, Nutella, <laughs> tissues, jet skis, video cameras, video games, skyscrapers, jewelry, just think about all that stuff, medicine, the stock market, how, how, would, how would you start a thing like the stock market? Like, how would you explain to people back in the time, like, oh, yeah, this, this we should make something uh, where you can uh, buy small pieces of a company, and if it goes up, it, it, you can make money from it. Like, how would you do that? Like, think about the computer. Like, how, how would you possibly, uh, how would you possibly make, like, a, uh, a touch screen, like, track, like, a, tu uh, a, a touch trackpad? like and a, and a mouse like how would you do that like think about it like how would you even how would you even know how to do that like think about all this stuff we have today that we don't know how to make and we just take it like we just go out to the mall and we can buy it like if I were to go back in time I sure as hell I'd be able to explain all of these things to the people back in the back then but like I would not be able to just like to make it again so just if you guys know any other things that would just be like really weird to think about and it's like to go back in time, like what would you redo, like recreate, if you went back in time? Like it's just, it's just amazing to think about. And uh, you could also make like certain predictions, which would be really cool about the past. For example, you could predict uh, the fall of Rome, the fall of Greece, the fall of Persia, what just any fall of empires, and you could predict it, and you can just become famous, I guess. You could say that the world is uh, round and that the earth rotates around the sun and the moon rotates around the earth which was highly controversial up until like up until it was like proven in the, the I think it was like the the high teen or middle teen centuries but I am not even sure and like uh, what else the existence of a new world of America you can predict the world wars who would win you could predict uh, the stock market crashes. You could predict, yeah, you could go back in time, October 29th, 1929, I think it is. And you could go like the day before that and you should be like, tomorrow, the stock market is going to crash. And you should take out all your money the day before it and then just like tell people and then just like, I don't know, that would be awesome. I don't know if you guys have seen Dimitri Martin, but he has this like comedy skit. He's just like, he goes back in time to, uh, to predict the stock market. And there's the Moab right there going off. Pretty sick. This guy goes flawless. Forty-two now. Anyway, uh, Dimitri Martin, he goes in this one of his skits. He's a comedian. He goes back in time to like the day before the stock market crashes and just like, okay, if the stock he like goes up to this like, really hot girl and goes like, if the stock market crashes tomorrow, 
you have to have sex with me. And she's like, sure, because the stock market's not going to crash tomorrow, because cause it was back in the roaring 20s when everything was going just fine and dandy. The stock market crashed the next day, and, and he got he got it in. <laughs> so, so you guys can do that. Uh, what else? The assassinations of presidents and, and world leaders. 9-11. Uh, you could say the laws of gravity and motion, explain what the future will be like, you could predict presidential elections, uh, you could predict lottery numbers, you could predict, uh, the creation of, like, amazing things like Google and stuff like that. So just, just think about that, that's just absolutely insane, um, just let me know in the comments, guys, more, uh, video ideas that you would like to see. Just because, I don't know, I like making videos about you, what you guys want to see. So and I like I like just making videos. I would make videos even if no one saw them. Although not making videos and reading the comments is always nice. I really like doing that a lot. And uh, I feel like this commentary has gone very smoothly. I feel like uh, I'm not saying I'm not like stuttering and other all that other stuff is badly because I'm I'm getting better at the commentaries. So uh, one little interesting tidbit that I saw on Facebook, which I don't know if it's true or not, but like the origin of like you know people sag their pants low like. Like hang their hang their ass out, like I saw a video like a post on Facebook where it said the origin of that was like people in jail that would want to get like raped because people in jail like want to have sex and like if you want to get raped you'd wear like your pants like below your waist so nowadays people want to get raped technically when they wear their pants low whatever just whatever <laughs> leave a comment saying Moab in the uh, as long as what you'd want for a PlayStation or Microsoft points card I'm Constantine. Peace.